Right, guys, so we are now on turn 300, and I have never seen such an order tied domination in my life. Like, oh wow. But anyway, let's get into it. So, Nagorand has been taken over by Grombrindle over here, and is actually at war with the High Elves right now, as you have seen. Um, there's so many armies in Ulth yeah, 1. Like, Ulth 1. It's just getting wrecked by the dwarves. I feel like the dwarves are just angry with everyone at the moment. Uh, so, yeah, going down, you've got Bretonia in here. Not at war with anyone, but really hating the dwarves. So, if I kept this going, I think the dwarves would even go to war with Bretonia. It's very odd that Valkyr is still alive up here. Um, yeah, very random that she's not been taken out. She's just been sitting there idling for most of the campaign. Uh, Marathi is surprisingly still alive, although he's slowly been taken out by Bretonia and, well, the High Elves haven't really done much. They're sort of dealing with their Dwarven problem. But it's nice to see that Marathi is still kind of kicking. Fangs and uh, kind of a bit scared to expand anywhere, to be honest. Uh, moving down, Lustria is all it's a, although there is a massive invasion over here by Thoric. Uh, so, yeah, it looks like Thoric is going to start pushing his way into the jungles over here. So, who knows where that war would go. Uh, the Southern Chaos Way is completely dominated by the Dwarves and the Empire. As well as pretty much everything, to be honest. Yeah, there's no wars going on in the center over here. I think I've already just discussed all the wars that have been going on that I could see. Everyone is kind of at peace. Um... Yeah, just everyone got wrecked by what? Turn 200, all of the destruction and chaos factions had died, like all of them. Uh, Cathay, nothing's been going on here for about another 100 turns or so. The chaos dwarves did very well until they kind of got crumbled by the actual dwarves. Um, but yeah, it was nice to see they were doing well for the majority of the campaign. But yeah, that's kind of it. There's nothing really going on anymore. It's just a war between Thoric and Itza. And the Dwarfs and the High Elves over here. Um, but yeah, nothing really to say about this one. It's still a bit of a shame that it's massively Order Tide favoured. It would have been nice to see some of the Destruction Factions doing well somewhere on the map at some point. But no, it's still very, very Dwarf favoured. The Order Resolve for the Dwarfs is just ridiculous. It needs a nerf somewhere. Because once they get going, they just they just steamroll the entire map. And I do think if I do kept going, like they're hating Bretonia, they're going to wipe out Bretonia. They'll probably piss off the Empire while doing that. In fact, the Empire, the Dwarves hate the Empire as well. So I feel like if I just kept going, the Dwarves would just hate everyone and just take over everything. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it for this one. Um, if you're enjoying this kind of content, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye for now.